Hey guys, it's Alex from AMD's Card Collection, and I'm back with another video. Um, got a mail day video, so this is from my first ever uh, ComC uh, order. So I decided to try them out and pick up um, a bunch of PC cards for a pretty good deal. Um, so I ended up paying for like the express shipping to get this really quick, just because it was like $13 to get it uh, by, it said December 7th, but this is obviously earlier than that, or wait until like February and it would have been like five bucks. So I decided I might as well just pay a little bit extra just because I wanted to get in before Christmas. Um, so I got two different stacks here. Not a huge order. Let's see. Yeah, Target ship December 3rd. It's before that. Um, I'll start with this one first actually. So I'm going to explain a lot of the reasons why I picked out certain cards because you might be confused. Never seen or why, know why I PC certain people. Um, so it's pretty easy to use. Picked out, like I said, a ton of different cards for a ton of different players and stuff that I uh, I collect. Really cool. So just wanted to give it a shot and see what I think about it. Okay, so first up, this one's in a top loader. I don't know if they just top load the first one anyway. But it was like 25 cents to add a top loader to most cards. And I didn't do it just because I, I have a bunch of top loaders. So this one, Rated Rookie Admiral Schofield. Um, just had wanted to get a couple of Admiral Schofields, or at least one, because I was a big fan of him at Tennessee, watching him play with Grant Williams and Jordan Bowe and a couple other guys. I was one of my favorite college basketball teams to watch. So he was my favorite from that. I think he's got really good potential. So I just wanted to get a couple of his rookie cards. So that's the reason for that one. Um, we'll do the back card. Then... NFL debut Henry Ruggs and most of these cards were like less than a dollar or around a dollar So like a dollar for Henry Ruggs rookie obviously SEC wide receiver plays for Alabama So mosaic is a good-looking set. I don't really Mind the NFL debut versus a regular rookie. So it's like a dollar cheaper for the NFL debut. So I'll take those all day So nice mosaic rookie card of him there And then I guess the rest of these aren't gonna be top-loaded Right. So this should give you a good look at a bunch of different things that I, I might not have shown out before that I PC or collect or anything like that. So right here we've got a Lonnie Walker, the fourth um, Essentials rookie card. I think this one's from Chronicles. So yeah, Chronicles. Um, I think this is a really, really nice looking card. He's got a lot of potential as well, but I really liked watching him at Miami. Another uh, college basketball guy. I watched him at Miami and then with the Spurs, I watched him a little bit. Real explosive player. So it's just another. I watched quite a bit of Miami basketball just, just because. So there's another like random player there. And then Floyd Gator here. I will really like the red on red. 111 out of 349, Vernon Hargraves. Now with the Texans. But he's definitely my favorite cornerback to come out of Florida. Um, yeah, I guess my favorite cornerback that I've watched at Florida. And C.J. Henderson's a close second. So that's really cool. It looks really nice. This is actually before Phoenix was like a chrome. This is 2016, so it's like a foil. I didn't really know that until I was looking for, uh, for cards for Hargraves. So that's pretty interesting. All right, next one. Rookie of DeMar DeRozan. One of my favorite basketball players. Just when I started watching basketball when I was younger... I got I like the Raptors, thought they were cool, and DeMar DeRozan's my favorite, so I really hated when he got traded to the Spurs, and then they won the championship just because I felt like that was such a smack in the face to DeMar because he leads them in tons of stuff for their franchise and led them to all those playoff appearances but can never get to the championship. So that's really cool to have. Again, like really cheap for a superstar rookie card, so that's awesome. Definitely a huge one for the PC. And then a rated rookie, Tim Tebow. Just obviously Tebow PC, one of my biggest guys. Um, I think the rated rookie from 2010 Donruss, so I think this is actually a super nice looking design. So Florida guy, obviously. Great card to add to PC as well. I think this is a great looking insert, and it's Jakeem Grant, who does not have a ton of cards. So that was pretty cool. I, I really like this insert with the dolphin logo there and like the the like shadow effects and stuff like that. Like I said, 
like these were all like most of them were under a dollar this one was probably like 60 cents or whatever so 2018 panini he's had a couple of nice uh, returns definitely definitely a, a giant component of our team's success in the special teams department then duke dawson number 207 of 225 uh, Luminance Orange Parallel. The orange looks awesome with the Florida Gators colors and everything. So just a cheap rookie numbered card for Duke Dawson. Another one of my favorite Florida Gator uh, defensive backs. He was a lockdown corner for us. I think he's now with the Broncos. Not 100% sure about that. Then next, I don't know how I didn't have one of these, but I had to buy one. Um... Looks like there might be a little bit of like stuff on the surface or whatever. Might be able to see if I can get that off. But just Topps Chrome, Jarvis Landry. So obviously he's my, my favorite player. So had to get a Topps Chrome rookie of his. So there's the autograph back there of Topps Chrome. Yeah, I just hadn't, hadn't ever picked a Topps Chrome rookie up. So just figured might as well. So that's really cool there. Uh, this is the set I've been working towards completing. The Thunder and Lightning from 2018 playoff. So this was one of them that I'm... Um, I was missing, I think there was like eight I was missing and I got like six of them and I just forgot to look up the other two or something like that. So I'm pretty close to completing that set there. Uh, Elite Series Rookies, Marquise Brown. Uh, I really like the look of the Elite Series Rookies from Don Russ. It's 2019. Um, Marquise Brown, I was a really big fan of him at uh, Oklahoma. I don't know, I watched... I watched quite a bit of Oklahoma just because they're usually a pretty good team and they throw the ball a lot. It's so like him and C.D. Lamb, I like both of them. He ended up going to the Ravens. Hasn't made much of an impact this year, but we'll see if he can turn that around. So just a nice living card. Another Duke Dawson numbered card. Super, super nice looking. Score artist proof. And that is number 27 of 35. So like a really nice short print. The blue looks awesome with the Florida Gators colors. Super cool short print that I got for really cheap again. So it's so nice because there's a lot of cards that like I appreciate inserts and numbered cards and just base rookies and stuff and cool looking sets that I can get them and not have to pay like three bucks of shipping on a $2 card every time. So I might use this more, but I just want to do like a, a trial run kind of. Uh, AJ Brown, absolute one of the cheapest rookies he had. I wanted to get more of his stuff because I don't have a lot of it, but his stuff is obviously decently expensive with how he's playing this year. So... Obviously, Ole Miss, SEC wide receiver. I think this year's absolute is actually a decent-looking set with the foil for the rookies. So, there we go. Then, one of my favorite SEC wide receivers outside of, like, the big six guys is uh, Calvin Ridley. Alabama, I, I like watching their receivers a ton. Some absolute studs. This is, this is a great-looking card with the, the foil and, like, the square pattern kind of deal. So, Obviously, his stuff has gone up a ton, but luckily, inserts don't actually go up that much um, as opposed to their regular rookie cards, and I'm okay with that because I think this looks better than his base Donruss rated rookie anyway, so really happy with that. Having a stud year. Um, carry on Johnson Optic. I, I had to get this one just to just to rub in Justin's face. That's really the only only reason I got this card. In all seriousness, seriousness though, I do, I do like carry on Johnson, though, from Auburn. So hope he continues to, to play well. But I mostly got that just to poke fun at Justin. So there you go. One of my favorite Dolphins growing up. Probably my favorite. Ronnie Brown rookie card. I love the look of this 2005 top set. Also had the Alex Smith rookie card from that. So just really cool to, to pick up a rookie card of, of one of my favorite uh, Dolphins of all time. Right there. So that's really awesome. Score Hot Rookies, or actually this is from the Hot Rookies set. So there was a Hot Rookies insert, and then there was, or this, I don't know. Maybe. There was a Hot Rookies set, and there's also the Hot Rookies insert and score. I don't know if that Hot Rookies at the bottom means it's from the score or the Hot Rookies set, but super cool foil card, like the Hot Rookie, like Flames and everything. So Jarvis Landry Rookie, just another one that... Try to pick up most of his uh, rookie cards that I don't have in Dolphins uniform. So, try and round out that PC. So, that's awesome there. Another Jarvis Landry. I think the most of the, the dude I got the most of was Jarvis Landry because he's my favorite. Um, this just looks incredible. 
from 2016 Optic. This is the Aqua Parallel, and it just goes the, op the Aqua with the orange, with the logo, and everything just looks so nice. So absolutely love the look of that card. And that's numbered 67 out of 299. So just another super nice looking Jarvis Landry numbered card to add to the collection. I'll try and speed up this second stack as it's getting 10 minutes already. Then I don't know what happened to this sleeve. So I'm going to take that out and get a new one. Obviously condition on these, like, like I said, these are really cheap. Uh, way to get a bunch of nice PC cards, so I'm not concerned about grading them or anything like that. Uh, Mike Conley, rookie, from 2008 Tops, I believe. Yeah, 7 8 Tops, rookie. Uh, also have a Horford from this set. Horford was a Gator, so a PC of mine. And then Conley, just love the Grizzlies. They're, they're my second team behind the Heat. Um, and Conley was my favorite. I like that grit and grind with uh, Randolph and Marcus Gasol. Tony Allen, all, all those guys, so wanted to grab a rookie card of his, just like DeRozan, another guy I'm a huge fan of. So it's really cool to add like a dollar, dollar twenty-five PC rookie card. And then this one has a few of the nicer cards, I think. Not a lot of numbered cards in this, just got a lot of nice PC cards, so. But again, can't complain. I mean, I think I got like 32 cards in total and it cost me like 40-some bucks and most of it was shipping getting the advanced shipping. All right, so here we go. This one is the only autograph I think I got. Um, I just decided to pick this up because Malcolm Mitchell was a stud. He didn't really do anything at the pro. He's got a great looking signature. Um, the Patriots picked him and I think he was battled with injuries a lot. Didn't really do anything, but this was like a $2 autograph card. So $2 autograph cards for my SEC wide receiver PC. I'll take all day. So Really like that one there. And then the back card, I can't believe this All one. right, sorry about that, got a phone call, but here's the Alex Smith Vertex. I don't know what the, they call like the blue one, but this is still a really awesome looking card. 18 out of 99, 18 is my uh, jersey number, so that's even better. So super cool, awesome, awesome to pick this up for really cheap. I guess I did have a second card for Justin, but that's to complete that set as I was telling you about earlier. Looks like that last card in the sleeve might have gotten mangled again. Pull that forward, yeah. Man, that sucks. Hopefully the corner's okay. Yeah, the top of this is Kind of messed up. Corner looks okay. So this is another one that I didn't have. One of the best looking sets from 2014. Topps Platinum. One of Topps' best sets in my opinion. So another one just for Jarvis Landry PC. Really cool there. Alright, then Thunder and Lightning. Yeah, I got two of them here. So the Melvin Gordon, Keenan Allen, and Marvin Jones and Golden Tate. So two more to help complete that set. We're six and ten. Like I said, I think I have like two or three more that I don't have. And this one, I love this card because it's like a great SEC wide receiver card. Matching numbers, AJ Green and Calvin Ridley, both wearing 18. That's also my number, so that's even even cooler. That's why I had to pick that up. It's an acetate from uh, Illusions. So it's a rookie for Calvin Ridley, but that's really cool. Um... There's the red, Tease Tabor, uh, Florida Gator. He's a really good DB for us. He was with the Lions, don't know where he is now. That's out of 2017 Elite Collegiate. It's like the orange parallel, so that looks good with the Florida colors too. I guess there's one more, the Thunder and Lightning, the Ajayi Alshon Jeffrey. This one, I mean, there was tons of Riley Ridley stuff that I could get for cheap. So he was Georgia wide receiver. He actually gotten a little bit of playing time with the Bears. I know Bears fans aren't a fan of him, but I like him. I think he, he has some potential. They just need to, to change up the quarterback. They're starting Mitch again, so we'll see how well that goes. So this is out of uh, Phoenix, 244 out of 299. Just a good-looking uh, red parallel there. 
Keenan Allen. I'm a big fan of him. So Keenan Allen rookie card. Got this for really cheap, so pretty cool to add to the collection. Here we go. Here's another Admiral Schofield. This is the like optic, um, like the premium edition set or whatever like that. Like Silver Wave. Super cool looking card there. So that's also nice. I explained him before. Ronnie Brown, sweet picture. Love that picture. Top Scrum Refractor. I think this is 2012, 2011. So just a cool refractor of Ronnie Brown for cheap. Couldn't pass that up. Getting towards the end here, we've got Devontae Parker. It's like the, the red foil or the flame parallel. I don't remember what they call it. 2015 Tops Fire. So obviously another one of my huge PCs there. So that's really cool. Uh, Laquan Treadwell from 2016 Classics. Dude who I thought was going to be like DK Metcalf and AJ Brown from Ole Miss. Had so much potential. And then I, he broke his leg and just never really has been able to recover from that. He's taken first round, I think, as well. Absolute monster in college. Just unfortunate injury. Then Keanu Neal. Didn't have any of his rookie cards, so just picked one up. Interesting that it's facing the Dolphins there. Um, so, one of my favorite Gators in the league right now. Huge hitter. Plays really well for Atlanta. Got my card stack falling over. And then, last but not least, Origins. 131 out of 150. Orange Parallel, Antonio Gates. Probably my favorite tight end of all time. I uh, love watching him and Rivers tail end of his career for the Chargers. So definitely one of my favorite players to watch growing up. So uh, that's it. Giant stack of cards for cheap. A ton of really cool stuff. Get to see a little bit more of what I, what I like and collect. So uh, thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys next time.